Yo, man, man, we gotta stop fucking beating around the bush, man. Let's keep it a bean here, man. <laughs> what y'all be doing? What, what y'all be doing? Do y'all be fucking I mean, in here? No. Alright, cause we said we wasn't gonna be beating around the bush. Oh, no, I mean, we gotta keep it real. A lot of people don't know what an afty is. People be like, what's an afty? Right. Well, I think they used to call them locked doors. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Could you talk up a little? Love, <clears throat> I'm sorry. Um, at after hours for me, it starts between two to like six, seven, eight a.m. I've seen other ones that's like. Damn. What the longest you ever went? From like two to like six, seven. So what be taking place? I I, I walked in one, okay, but I so walked right out. I never went like. When, what? Hours, hours. After hours, like to me. Like an after party, like ain't nothing else to do. Oh, it's popping over here for like right. another hour or two. Right. But in your situation, no, it's, it's different. After hours, it's a club. It's like a strip club. club. It can be in different locations. It can be in somebody's house, the backyard. Uh, like. So is the after hour about music? It's about a lot no, of things. It's, like, it's, it's a lot it's of things. Music. It's about music. It's about the money. Yeah. Because I look at it like this. When I leave it's a about club, the money, the environment. Most motherfuckers don't want to stop partying. They still that's what want I'm in. Right. For me, drink, mingle, whatever. For me, it's about the entertainment because I am the entertainment. So uh, I feel like people underestimate me because I'm so small, and then when they actually see me, they be like, "Oh shit!" Like, what do they see? Like, like what? Like I said, when I'm a person underestimates you, and they and they see something, what they see that make them go, "Oh wow!" Like, what the well, I feel like when you do splits upside down or something. Hold on, hold on, hold on, man. Yo, man, we gotta stop fucking beating around the bush, man. Let's keep it a bean here, man. <laughs> what y'all be doing? What, what y'all be doing? Do y'all be I fucking mean, in here? No. Alright, cuz we said we wasn't well, gonna be beating around the bush. Oh, we I mean, gotta keep it real. We gonna we we gonna we gonna let, oh, let us know what's going on. Yeah. Like before, like when you did the locked doors, like yeah. it right. was like a lot of that shit going on. See, I'm from that yeah. era. Our yeah. locked doors yeah. was straight up. Facials yeah. and back facials shots. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And what do like you mean by facials? Face like what? Facials is when somebody, a girl take their face yeah. and put it on your jewel. Okay, yeah. all right, all right. And massage you. Okay. Right. Right. Now, that's my era of locked door. Right. right. You right. know what I mean? They call it locked doors and once you in, you in. You locked in. You locked in. Okay. See, the athletes now is more like a party, a strip club. They don't want to stop. And you could get dates or fuck. I it's interviewed a girl back in the day, and I don't want to say the dude's name, but he a superhero. Right. That's all I'm say. Oh, man. He's a superhero. <laughs> and he had one of his dancers, and she said she was a dancer. And I was talking to her, and she had a war. Like awards, nigga. Right. She had a I sucked thirty niggas off for one day award. Oh yeah. Dang. Um, um, I let fourteen I niggas smash in one night. I been she had the papers. Right. I ain't been in those so she's certified. She's certified. Dang. And nobody can fuck with. So you ain't trying to be certified. Nah. I okay. Been, you feel me? I be in there making my ass shoot too. Yeah. Oh wow, you ain't trying to get the certificate. So you, no, no, no. Okay. You okay. got ass shit muscle control. Yeah, yeah, yeah that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You mean to tell me you could take one cheek and make a jump like that? Mm -hmm. You lying. You lying. She's lying. She's lying because, yes, I want to see. I want to see because I'm the type that don't believe in a lot of shit. I got right, people always talk. They don't talk that don't shit. Don't keep it a bean. <laughs> you got to keep it a bean. On this motherfucker, you know what I mean? That's what you gotta do. Yeah, right. Oh, uh, shit. And, and, um, oh, she not playing. Gotta have cheap control. Gotta have cheap control. Gotta have cheap control. Oh, shit, man. That, that's crazy right there. For y'all that don't see it right now, she's demonstrating real professionalism. She's showing you how to control one cheek to the other. Right. It's a sport. That has to be learned by a lot of females if they want to keep their men. Practice. Right. Practice. They want to keep their men. It takes a lot practice. of practice and it takes a lot of money. Yeah, the athlete practice. You, I, I'm in the house doing this. Like, practice, watch, practice. practice. So, so you, really, you literally be in the house practicing these moves? 
Yeah. You do splits? I be in the gym stretching, so yeah, I do the splits. What, what kind I of gym you go to? Oh, you be over there? Warden, you train her? Nah, I never train her. Yo, Warden, what? Come on, Warden, man. You, <laughs> you train people. Why wouldn't you train her? I have been training in a minute, no, though, like, man. No, I didn't want to do that. I just wake up. I just didn't want to get to school. On the days I'm going to walk down here and go sleep. Now, let me ask you a deeper so, question. And it's real. And I need you to speak into the camera. Because I'm trying to help people. Right. If your kids were to see something like that, what would you tell them? Good question. I haven't thought about that. Never thought about it. Because mine's are so young. Well, it don't matter once they get older. Like, right. Boy, I was doing me. Uh, oh, I was doing this for you. I did, did, I did I'm this for y'all. You got that PS6? Nigga, he got me So, if your daughter was to grow up and say, Mom, I want to dance, how would you respond to that? It wouldn't be ideal, but I'm going to. You will understand. In my head, anything that my kids to do, I'm going to want to support them. Support them and tell them to put 100% or whatever that is so that eventually it's going to make 100% back in my life. I'm glad we talked to you because I always wanted to know something. How do your men, if you have one, or men that you dealt with, deal with the fact that you out after hours? Um, some men, and I started doing it when I was single. I've been single like the last four years. I just got to be able to you know. Um, he know, like what? Like how? When you come home, like that, that's what I'm trying to understand, like, right? mm -hmm. cause I'm a man. Right? Okay. And, but for me, it's like if I can share that part of me with you, I'll tell you, it ain't nothing for me to lie and hide. The book. Okay. I think a man gotta be a real strong motherfucker mm -hmm. to know his woman is dancing, mm -hmm. muscle controlling. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. And then you come home. It's like, what do he do? Like, do he, like, do it excite? Do it no, excite him or something? He might be sleeping. I got it. Just go into, we, I go straight into parenting mode. It's not. Going to what mode? Parenting mode. Like, it's not really, like, and, you sit there and have a conversation. And but you don't think, like, you don't, you don't ever come home I mean, no, and jump on the I was doing that before we got together, so it's like. Oh, no. Oh, at this point. No, hold up. If you meet a, a girl at dance, or if a girl meet a guy that dance, and they understand that they dance, I don't think they should have a problem. I think it's like my dad yeah. is like real tight. She's she been doing what that before. I'm going yeah. in it to do and what. Now, know. if you're going out late nights it's talking about you a motherfucking nurse. <laughs> <laughs> so. Now, that's a yo, no, quick right. story. Yeah, yeah. About 20 some years ago, I met a chick. She said she was a nurse. Mm -hmm. Every time I called that night, she never answered the phone. Right. One day I goes to a locker door. My boy, I didn't know where the locker door was. My mm -hmm. boy said, yo, come with me to this locker door. Right. I go to the locker door, and, and it's the same spot you're talking about. Shorty on the pool table, kicking right. up. But it's a okay, different time right now because back then it was something to kind of hide. Now it's like the shit is just hold hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everybody um, wants to monetize off of some But type back of then. Up. Back then it was yeah. sacred. You said you walked in the um, locked door and she was on the pool I table. I walked in the locked door. I just spoke to her. She right. said she in the hospital. Yeah, yeah. Right. You feel know I me? Mean? Uh -huh. So I'm walking in like, hold up. <laughs> and I never did nothing with her at right, this point. Right, right. Did that night. But at this point, right. I did it. Right. You know what I mean? I go over there. I'm like, yeah. When I tap her, she was like, Oh my God, I ain't know you be in this shit like Oh my God, I'm like, look, right. I'm like, look, I'm like, I'm not mad. I'm just mad you ain't tell me I had to find out this way. Yeah, yeah. How much you charge? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you like that? I mean, then we went. So, with, so, so, what, go ahead, proceed. I want to We went up in there, we had a good time and shit like that. And we, we, we became, we, we, we became friends after that. But I told her, I said, You went up and where though, Warden? Oh, and the lock doors back in them days, you should go in the room. Oh, all right. Be other motherfuckers in there, but it's dark. Yeah. All you hear is old kind of noise. Okay, <laughs> so you went up in there where? Yeah, okay, I, yeah. I was here. Because when you went up in Alabama, yeah. I met okay. one of my niggas in there because I heard his voice like, Girl, girl. Uh, I'm like, hold the fuck up. I'm like, George, that's you? Yeah, He's like, Dude, that's you? Yeah, that's you. Yeah, that's you. Yeah, that's you. That's so funny, boy. Oh, shit. Yo. Oh, yo. shit, man. Yo.
Yeah, yeah. Turn the light on for a minute, uh -huh. all of them like this. Like, <laughs> right. Turn the light up. But the moral is, if she wouldn't have lied, I wouldn't have felt hurt. Right. I felt hurt because, like, she said she was a nurse. Right. And it fit the criteria. Mm -hmm. She never answered the phone at night. She always talked about she ain't not, you know what I mean? Right. You know? So I'm glad that locked doors evolved from the locked doors of my era. Right. You know what I mean? Because my era, we was playing. for me? You know, I'm glad we met Sugar. I mean, Sugar, she on her ground. Yeah, yeah. She's a stand up woman. Any, any, any woman that could, could like own up to what they do and, and have a reason for doing it, I fucks with. Yeah, yeah. You know I and mean? I fucks with. You, you get, you what she did, she kept it a being. Kept it a being. That's what it's all about. Y'all should go follow me, and if y'all just can't care, y'all should go follow my business page, which is SOS underscore skin.